Let's start with the latest diplomacy between North Korea and the U.S. And it's a case of you've got mail for U.S. President Donald Trump. He says North Korean leader Kim Jong-un has sent him another letter as the two sides look to start engaging each other again on the regime's denuclearization. Park ji won with this report. Speaking to reporters on Air Force One on Friday as he traveled to a campaign event in North Dakota, U.S. President Donald Trump said a letter from North Korean leader Kim Jong-un is being delivered to him, and he expects it to be a positive one. He added the letter was handed over at the inter-Korean border a day earlier. Watchers expect this might refer to Friday Korea time when general-level military talks between the North and the United Nations Command took place at the inter-Korean border village of Panmunjom, discussing the joint recovery of the war remains of U.S. service members killed during the Korean War. President Trump added that his Secretary of State Mike Pompeo will deliver Kim's letter to him when he returns to the U.S. from his visit to India. It's Kim's fourth personal letter to President Trump since the first letter was sent in June. The first letter, which Trump evaluated as very nice, salvaged the almost canceled North Korea-U.S. summit in Singapore in mid-June. Kim's previous letter to President Trump was sent early last month as North Korea repatriated war remains of U.S. troops back to their homeland. Late last month, Trump canceled Pompeo's fourth visit to North Korea, citing a lack of sufficient progress on denuclearization. Now the question is whether Kim's latest direct message to President Trump could reignite the once-stalled denuclearization talks between the two sides. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.